Hello friends and welcome to Techie Jack. In this video we are going to create a new Google Ads account and we will try to create our first campaign. So let's get started. I have a two example for you. Uh, this is a hotel website uh, pacifickanatal.com uh, It's a place in Uttarakhand. It's a very beautiful place. So it's a hotel website and another one is a paperclicks.in it's a digital marketing website if I go through the navigation like it's a home about us SEO and all these uh, menu are there so if I have to create a different campaigns for this website I have to create a, uh, one campaign for SEO another for SMO or PPC video marketing that means we have to identify like what kind of campaign I have to create for my website so in this scenario if you navigate your website you can see the SEO would be a one uh, uh, one campaign targeting to the location whatever you need and the PPC would be the another campaign and uh, video marketing will be the another campaign all these services should have a different different campaigns inside the account and if you go to this hotel website and this person the owner of this uh, website is just concerned about uh, hotel uh, room booking so if we want uh, uh, someone to book the room what we can do we can adjust something on the home page like if we are targeting our home page as a landing page there should be a relevancy between the target page like the landing page should have a good uh, user experience and it should relate with the keyword like uh, you should think like a customer like uh, what should be my customer typing over the internet when they are searching for my location or uh, searching a hotel in my location like they would be searching like best hotel in Kanatal or they might be searching like affordable hotel in Kanatal or cheap hotel in a Kanatal so this would be my keywords and I will have to think like uh, I can put a text here like welcome to the Pacific Kanatal the best hotel in Kanatal like best hotel in Kanatal that is my keyword so it will be relevant to my keyword and my ad group can be like uh, hotels in Kanatal the ad group will be that and I can create ads like the best the Pacific Kanatal the best hotel in Kanatal book now so instead of read more we can just put here book now and we can redirect that uh, book now button to a, a page uh, where the booking can be done so this can be done this is just for an example to show like uh, we have to match the relevancy so that we can get a good quality score if we have a good quality score that means we are paying less for the click instead of other paying uh, uh, more for those clicks so let's go and start with first with this website this is a hotel website and uh, let's create and try to create a new Google ad account so you what you can do you can go to a ads.google.com or you can search for uh, Google AdWords I have a, a email address created with this email like uh, info at pacifickanatal.com I have an email address created and I just type ads.google.com and I clicked on next it's a company email address uh, I just created for the Google my business and I didn't create uh, any of the uh, Google Ads account on this uh, email address this is the first time I am going to uh, create this but already a Google uh, my business account was created so it's it took it automatically so if you go and click on like uh, uh, what's main what's your main advertising goal so Google want us to uh, navigate to these things and you can uh, select these automatic things like get more calls or you need a f visit to a physical location or you need a more website sales or sign up if you pick a goal with this that means it will be automatic process and Google will divert you to the different way you can divert your page to something else like if you not need to click on these things right now you can just go and click on experience with Google Ads because if you click on these things it might create a Google Express account for you 
but if you say like experience with Google Ads so Google ad will be created the Google Ads account will be created so I clicked on experience with Google Ads so now I uh, will be diverted to some other page otherwise I would be diverted to another page if I would have clicked on like pick a goal or or if I would have uh, went through the Google's option so you can just click on uh, experience with Google Ads and here is a search option display video app or shopping so shopping ads are for a product like you want to uh, sell your product online you can just uh, create this campaign for that and if you want someone to download the apps so you can uh, choose this option if you are going with a video marketing you can just go with this option if you want to display advertisement like uh, you want to uh, do a branding for your business you can uh, go for the display and you can reach a more and more uh, target audience but the most of the thing and the most of the time the search campaign is very powerful campaign so we are going to cl click on search and here again it's going to tell us like what is your goal like you want a sales you want a leads or you want a website traffic you can go with this way but uh, I don't want to go with this way I want to go with the, like a create a campaign without a goal because everything I want to do is a manually so you can just click on create a campaign without a goal and you can say website visit I require I require phone call I don't have an app so I'm not uh, clicking this and this is a website URL you can just type the website URL from here I will say the website URL is this and the phone number is also there if I can copy this okay I can copy this and let's it's an Indian number so I will click on India and I'll paste it and click on continue so now we are in a campaign setting like it's a general setting and it's asking for a campaign name like uh, what you want to name your campaign like in this case I will type the hotel name like it's a Pacific Kanatal P-A-C-I-F-I-C-K-N-A-T-A-L this is the name of the campaign and what is a search network like uh, here's a search network and is a display network if I click on a display network it will show this ad on the display network as well but we are concerned about the search like people who are searching for the location or for the keywords uh, they are searching we want our ad to be shown there so I will just remove this option like I don't want to display my ad on a Google display network I'm concerned about the search network so that's why we have chosen the search uh, search campaign so now this is set as a search network and there are some other setting like at what time you want to start the campaign and at what date you want to end this campaign but we are not going to deal with this because we are doing it uh, manually and campaign URL option this is an option and if you want to set the campaign URL option this is something advanced we will not uh, do this uh, it right now and if you see the dynamic search ad settings if you want to se uh, set your ad as a dynamic like uh, it will create some headings uh, headline of the ad uh, related to your website like it will search your index like website index and it will create a automatic headings uh, but uh, I don't need this because I want a manual setting with this uh, campaign so that I can have a more control on my campaign so now we have another setting like targets and audience choose who you want to reach like which location you want to reach in this case if you want to select the country like if, because this is a hotel in India so I want to select the country like India and 
if you want to select another location like if you think like uh, this place is very popular and someone from the and the people from the United States or Canada are more interested in this place you, you can just add one more country uh, to this uh, uh, campaign like if you want I can just choose like enter another location like uh, I have to choose an India like if you want this is a, a example like if you want to target multiple uh, countries like India United States and that is a United States if you want to add more and more you can uh, add them but right now I am just uh, going with the country India so I'll select the India and another option this is a very important option like location option if you are uh, going with the location option you can see the people in or who show interest in my target location that means uh, if India like I have selected the location India in India my ad will be showing but uh, the people in or who shows interest in my target location like if the someone is in US and he's showing interest in my place like if he's searching from US uh, uh, the best hotel in Kanatal he might also see the result of this ad and he can click on my ad and if I want only the people t in my target location like my target location is India and if I select this option like uh, people in a regular in your target location like people in or regularly in your target location that means if the person searching from uh, Canada or US or Australia for the best best, uh, the best hotel in a Canada they would not see my ad but I if I select this option that means they will see my ad and if I uh, select this option like people searching for your target location that means the only people searching for my target location like they are searching from outside like if the a person is searching from Canada about uh, the location like the best uh, hotel in Kanatal or a hotel in Kanatal they will only see the ad and the person in India they might not see the ad so the this is a difference between all these three so right now what I'm targeting is I'm j I just want to target the people in India itself so I will choose the uh, this option like people in or regularly in your target location that means only the person who is in India that will be uh, those uh, those people will only can see this ad and here's the exclude like uh, exclude people in or who show interest if you uh, if I uh, select this option like people in or who show interest in your excluded location like the the location which is excluded that means the, uh, the excluded location will not be showing this ad and if I select this option like people in your excluded location that means the ad will be shown there if the uh, uh, on an excluded location like if I exclude any location here as as I show you like we can add the uh, location the same way uh, instead of targeting we can exclude the location if I exclude that location and I select the option this that means the ad will be shown to that my excluded location language that is a uh, English language I want to target as an English language audience here you can uh, target the audience like if you want to target some audience like you want some people to like uh, travelers uh, if you want someone as a travel industry people you can just target the travel uh, travelers like travel in market audience but I don't want to target it right now if you want someone like if you are creating a ad on a like uh, though the people who are searching for uh, universities you can target students in this uh, list you can target for the students so I'm not targeting and I'm keeping it as a manual like now the point is of a budget like what kind of a budget you want to spend in a day this is a, a, a budget spend in a day like I want to spend in a rupees uh, I want to spend rupees for example 400 rupees per day 
uh, that means now the 400 rupees will be set my budget in a per day and what will be the delivered method like standard or accelerated accelerated means like the Google will accelerate your budget like it will show your ad more and more and it can spend your money quickly so I am using the option like standard uh, every time you, you you should use the standard but if you want a uh, budget like if you want your ad to be shown uh, in some more aggressive way you can just select the uh, accelerated and ad will be displayed more and more and your budget will be uh, like your budget will be spent more quickly instead of uh, selecting accelerated I am selecting standard and bidding option like we have a multiple bidding option like uh, we have a uh, click uh, manual clicks conversion value conversion uh, but if you select the bidding strategy it's not recommended but if I select like bidding strategy if you want a maximize click you need a uh, enhanced CPC or manual CPC right now we will just talk about the manual CPC that means like manual CPC you can set the bid for your keyword uh, it's a manual bid for your keyword you can increase or decrease it maximize means like it will try to maximize automatically it will set the bid like uh, if you uh, say the maximize click that means uh, in order to get a click it will increase your bid automatically so I want more control on my campaign so I am selecting a manual CPC so manual CPC is there and the conversion like uh, for the conversion you have to set something like conversion tracking setup that is a part of a, some advanced thing so and this is a ad schedule like you want to schedule your ad all day or you want to schedule your ad from for example let's see I want to schedule my ad from 9 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. Uh, that means 10 p.m. all days like I want my campaign to uh, turn on at 8 p.m sorry at 8 a.m. and to uh, just end the campaign like pause the campaign at the 10 p.m. and this is the ad rotation like if you have created the multiple ads inside the ad group which we will create later on uh, we can just optimize best performing ad like the you can just rotate the ads like the which ad is performing best it uh, it will get more and more clicks the more and more click will be uh, get to that ad which is performing more well these are the option like if you want to select do not optimize or rotate that it will not optimize but by default uh, it is on optimize prefer best performing ad and this is a recommended setting so it is quite fine there and now we have a site link call out and call extension like site link means uh, you can uh, put a site link like as a book now like uh, if you want site link uh, now there is a site link and a call extension call out extension and we already have created the call extension so we will talk about the site link extension and call out extension later on because there are more other extension so if we go and create a like a save and continue uh, that means our campaign will be created our campaign will be set and after that we will have to create the ad groups ads and we have to set the keywords for our campaign so in our next video we will go ahead and create a ad group and we will create some ads and in that ad we will put some keywords so let's meet in the next video